So we just finished up a set of portals last night, four inch portals on an 18 Ranger. Now we're doing six inch portals on a 19 1000 because Josh uh, had money burning a hole in his pocket apparently. Some have, some stuff happens. <laughs> hey, I've done that before. Go to buy spark plugs for a jet ski and leave with a four wheeler. Hey, I went to buy an axle and left with six inch oh. portals. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you, uh, you're definitely gonna be a little tippier than you were. Huh? So you're gonna be a little tippier than you were. Eh, it'll be a little water though. Just a little bit. A little bit. So I know I didn't get to film much on the four inch portals because I was busy doing the trans. I said, I don't need to be any little tippier now. <laughs> so we'll get a little bit more footage on these since I neglected last night. Yeah, yeah it's okay though. Yeah, it's okay. But yeah, we yeah. need to straighten yeah. that up. All the, all the fancy parts. I need to probably cut this boot and straighten yeah, that yeah. Uh, tie rod out a little. Yeah. I mean, it's only a little bit. Just a little bit. <laughs> they stuck on there a little? Yeah, they stuck on there. They usually are. One yeah, yeah, it was probably about time to do this time. maintenance and everything, but they didn't even know. Well, especially after Georgia. No pads? No pads. Typical players. Yeah, typical side This is true. Anything that goes in the sand, mud, water. water. That thing don't come with new pads, does it? No, no it doesn't. Shit. I had to set at the house, too. I'll go in and get them real quick. I need to the way back to the house to get the damn pads. <laughs> We're going to be right there, and those are brand new rotors. What do you get a uh, half inch gun, Josh? Once you get this side apart, I'll jump on the other side. Why are you putting it all back together? Should I pull this clip on it? Pull this boot and yeah. unscrew that thing and get it out? Yeah. yeah, that's what I would do. Oh yeah, this thing's missing an axle too. On the same <laughs> side he bent the uh, tie rod. Hey, I tell you awesome what. kind of got us a little there. Got you. Got you a little bit. I heard you. I heard you rolled the thing over in the water. <laughs> I got a know. call at eleven o'clock at night. How much oil does this players take? I don't know what y'all are talking about. <laughs> yeah, it was a good time. I didn't know he had arch arms on the rear too. Yeah. Well, that one you got it. No, now he's going all out. Get right close in here and check out what AJ's doing. Nothing. Get all up in his all up in his face. <laughs> the right socket for the job helps. Not really. Not really. Can we grab another socket and put on there? Huh? Nothing. Because the axle cup stuck in the front diff. Alright, right next slide hammer. These are always fun. That's not gonna work. No these help? No. I tried it with the other one the other night. It didn't work. It ended up just being brute strength. Might work with a combination of that and the pry bar. Where are you getting the pry bar in it? Right here? 
the big hole above it. Right there. Oh, you can't even get into that thing. That's it right there. I know, but you can't get a hold of it. I had a tap on it. Tap, 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 tap. <laughs> Which one, though? The big Large one? one? Yeah, the big one. Or the big one? Right Either one. They're both heavy enough. This is what you call a redneck slide hammer. Take a ratchet strap and you wrap it around the cup. Wrap a hammer around there and you smack it. Um, Usually it'll work. Yeah, you just don't want it to come loose like that. No, you definitely don't want to. I've done that before. Yeah, I damn near took my face off. <laughs> don't stand behind me when I'm doing it. Hey, get it wrapped right around there nice and tight. Maybe that's not helping. Too much pressure. No, nope. broke the redneck slide hammer. Slide hammer. Ugh. Broke the redneck slide hammer. Yeah, it's got the perfect spot right there to put a, dag a daggone lady's foot in there. Put it. Sure. It's got the perfect spot for a lady's foot now. I got one. Uh, da, 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 but I do have. You're working. I'm filming. I right, can't have big screwdriver. Big screwdriver. Alright, finally got that axle cup out. She was seasoning that pretty good. All crusty, rusty. A little ring in there gets seized up in there and they don't like to pop out. But she's out now. So time to put a new one in, put this, pull the one now. All right, so I got all the bushings pushed into the rear brackets. AJ's still working on that one. Well, I had a problem. You did. A little complication. A little complication. That's stuff's sticky. Big Crescent Wrench. Where'd it go? What are you looking for? Big Crescent Wrench. What'd you do with it? You had it left. Yeah, he did. Right where he left it. On the ground, next to the press. Huh? Because he always does. He's good at that. Front portals are all on. Just have to put the tie rod back on this side. Now he's just riding the struggle bus with the rear axle. Trying to get it back in. Jack it up. I don't know, I'm like pull the box. You know, one of the pocket screwdrivers. Or a picker, whatever. Sometimes with a magnet. Huh? My box, yeah. Pocket screwdriver, up, up, up. AJ, I need the dead blow. Oh, we gotta put the actual, bro. Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> Good one, Josh. Hey. I'm watching you do it, I know. Yeah, you're sitting here watching me. You just fold it down, yeah. Let's see if you ride the struggle bus as much as AJ did. Pull that upper A-arm up further. Is that as far as it'll go? Yeah, it's the shock. There you go. You need to go in more? No, you're in. Uh, Looks like yeah, a little bit more. more. Just a little bit more. Yeah, 
Đấy. 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 Nào, Yên Có tên sổ Mơ chì xì nha tên sài Sắp sắp đơn Oh, I just take, take them and bend them over the put, front. Put it all the way in, just bend it over the front, yeah. Oh. Take that wrench. That'll work. That's how I have to bend it. Get it bent and then take the hammer and finish it off. Now you just gotta bust, bust the brake line off of it. What are you doing, dude? Weirdo. AJ's underneath here. Finishing up the uh, last brake line. Yay. Oh, yeah, I forgot we still gotta put that thing on. I was gonna go ahead and start on it. Yeah? Yeah, I got it. I got it, yeah. She all done. I don't know that. Actually, I probably is the wheel straight. Is that tire straight? It's pretty straight. You need to back up and then pull forward. Oh, shit. Josh, so. she's a big bitch. <laughs> I think you can go to like 35s and be fine. I think you need to go to 35. At least a 35. I think a wide, the one in the wide 35s. Oh yeah. Would look better. I know there's some 36 swampers, huh? 36 swampers. Yeah, I like, I like this look. Six inch on 33s. Actually, it don't look bad like that. Could use a little bit more poke, but. As soon as you back up and pull forward, it should settle in the rear. Yeah, we gotta watch out. Find out how it's a truck. And stepping into it. The brakes me. Or the. Or the Put the cat in. back on? It's not plugged in anymore. <laughs> oh, yeah, that might work. But sometimes you gotta pump the brake and yeah, push it hard. Watch out for Matt's tail. I can see him back there. Actually, I can see pretty good behind me now. You riding around and then pull it back in? Uh, he's back up, falling out to his bump. Me over? Hey, you're standing in front of it. Hold it right there. Do the ice. Stay with us. Yeah, it's gonna be. Once you get that tire rod, well, then we'll yeah, once it drop. Hey, it's wider. I won't roll it down. It ain't that much wider. It's a lot taller than it is wider. It's, a, it's at least six inches wider. Hey, throw it low and see how low that low is. See how that low the low is. It's tall. It's tall, but it looks good. It rides good. 
What's up, Mav? What's up, Mav? Mav, what's up, buddy? You gonna make your YouTube debut debut on this video? I can't even speak. Jeez. Make a YouTube debut of the video of him uh, chewing the two by four. Uh, no, because this tire's up 30% bigger. 30% reduction, so. Probably came with, what, 30s on it? You can definitely tell the difference. How, how, did, have you put it in low yet? Have you put it in low yet? No. Try it in low. That was a high. Try it in low. I know reverse is going to be low. Smoother too. Yeah, it's a lot smoother. You don't have that little, like the belt jerk or whatever. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. it's torquey. Is it? I'm gonna get runned over. Happy with that? Yeah. That's a great investment. I want those doors too. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, I think that does it for this video. Any final words, AJ? My, what's my pro tip today? I, you didn't have Josh, a pro tip. give us a pro tip. A pro tip. Yeah, a pro tip. Don't bend your tie rods. Yeah. Don't bring the axle. Keep all four wheels on the ground. Yeah. Well, what's That's the fun definitely. in that? Our first video literally had people, you and Dave, jumping. That's not keeping all four tires on the ground. Come on. So, okay, so let me rephrase that. Don't land on your what side. What was your life tip today? Your, your life tip when we were in the, what was it? You're never lost, it's just an adventure? Oh, yeah. Li okay. All right, ready? Ask me my pro tip for the day. All right, what's your pro tip for the day, AJ? You're never lost, it's always an adventure. All right. All right. That's good. All right, later, guys. The